you and K A R D S W O R L D D R U and K A R D S live in third world. Enjoy and dream more. In this world of life, some people are accustomed and habituated to social drinking of alcohol, including wine, vodka, brandy, and cocktails. Please listen and read to this total story by clicking the YouTube link. D R U N K A R D S W O R L D D R U N K A R D S live in third world. Enjoy and dream more. In this world of life, some people are accustomed and habituated to social drinking of alcohol, including wine, vodka, brandy, and cocktails. Please listen and read to this total story by clicking the YouTube link. World by Mantri Pragada Markandi Yulu, Hyderabad, India. Vocal recitation by Eden Soriano Trinidad, Philippines. Drunkard's World. As an author, I have a number of friends who are regular drinkers in the social circles. Drinking alcohol is not an issue. One can drink on few occasions. There is no problem. But continuously taking alcohol day in and day out and dreaming high and building castles in the air is not at all correct. Many people lost even their lives due to high and regular drinking. In this aspect, I would like to project few of the incidents below for the information and knowledge of all the readers and listeners. Drunk cards live in third world. Enjoy and dream more. In this world of life, some people are accustomed and habituated to social drinking of alcohol, including wine, vodka, brandy, and cocktails. Taking alcohol in business sector for maintaining business relations is one thing. Consuming alcohol of different types, including foreign brands, standard brands, local made alcohol by upper middle class people are another thing. Enjoying all types of alcohol brands each day by middle class people and lower middle class people on some occasions looks to be common everywhere. Taking local made liquor and other local made cheap liquor and toddy is very common and frequent by the hard labor. All the governments are getting quite a good amount of revenue through the sale of different types of various liquor brands. Few governments depend for substantial revenue through various types of taxes. Some governments encourage liquor sales and some governments do not encourage liquor sales. Few governments on earlier occasions banned liquor sales in their respective states, landed in trouble due to huge loss of government revenue, thereby failed to run the governance and administration and even lost the political power. On later years, the same governments which banned the liquor revoked the sale of liquor to raise the revenue substantially. During alcohol in top circles, social, business, and political circles has become the order of the day. Last, it is difficult to maintain the good business, social, political relations at all levels. Taking top alcohol brands, foreign brands, whiskey and scotch in such top circles looks to be a fashion and necessary. Whereas consuming liquor each day in and day out and partying every day may lead to problems. Few people only can afford to lead such lavish style of life. Some upper middle class people in various business fields and sectors take regular drunks. Mostly nowadays is seen in information technology or IT field, 
consume liquor on weekends, and enjoy a lot. But this is also a costly affair. Many people are in the middle class sector, habituated to liquor of all brands and consume liquor on a daily basis by spending their hard-earned money. Even hard labor costs, consumes local made liquor each day by almost spending their 60% of earnings. There are many risks involved after consuming liquor. Number of people each day fall prey to road accidents, while some people who drive in intoxicated condition, their two and four wheelers also meet with accidents. I have seen many people and few known friends who take alcohol on a regular basis right from morning and evening are financially helpless condition to meet their family expenses and are unable to meet their regular needs for their children's education. It is quite a saddening affair. Even some people who consume liquor daily are branded as drunk card and no social respect is given to them. I will give one example which I had on one occasion I engaged an auto rickshaw to go to city shopping mall. The auto driver had put on start the digital auto meter. After passing some distance, I was getting some alcoholic type smell in the auto rickshaw. I thought it was some petrol or diesel smell. After some time, I thought it was gas auto rickshaw. After a few minutes, I thought it fit to ask the auto driver about the smell which was emanating from the auto. I was able to judge that it was alcohol smell coming from the auto driver. No doubt, I was correct in my thinking. It was alcohol smell. Then I asked the auto rickshaw driver whether he was intoxicated with alcohol drunk. He replied boldly, stating that, sir, I took a small quantum of liquor. I told him to stop the auto rickshaw. Immediately the driver of the auto stopped. I asked him why you took alcohol when you are taking the passengers while charging for auto service. Is it not your duty to see the passenger safety? He politely replied, sir, sorry. It was a mistake taking alcohol and driving the auto. I told him that if you continue to take liquor or alcohol at this middle age, then I don't think you will live long and you will not be able to see your children's marriages and your grandchildren. Moreover, I told your spouse will have to do servant maid job or beg people for survival in case of any harm is done to your life. I told the auto driver straight away that people who are intoxicated with third brand liquor or local made liquor will not live long. Then the auto driver replied, Sir, I will stop drinking habit from now on. The driver realized the truth in my speaking to him on the facts. I got down at my place and the auto driver refused to take auto charges for my good advice. Drunkard habits are like this. They abscond to offices. They never work. They make money by pledging various articles, including gold and silver, for the sake of drinking. They quarrel when they are in bad moods. They don't speak properly. They even speak vulgar language outside as well as at home. They even quarrel with counterparts and their own children. They live in third world and their dreams are high. They make unnecessary chit chat, speak on waste subjects, and make time pass without any productive work. Intoxicated and drug addicted people never listen to others. They spend money towards alcohol, wine, and unintoxicated items and never give money to their spouse and children. I have seen many of the drunkards lost their jobs, dislocated their family status, landed in many criminal cases. Generally, drunkards become gamblers in one way or the other. 
gambling in the sense, playing cards, horse racing, numbered games, lottery, betting on various sports. It is observed that quite a number of horse racing punters consume liquor and bet during horse races on horses. It is very common that people play cards while consuming liquor of their choice and simultaneously smoke cigarettes. One could see in many places very lengthy parked motorcycles and cards in front of wine shops, bars, and restaurants, toady shops and in front of Hanata bars and star hotels. Many of the wine shops are located in thick residential places, near to temples, and even adjacent to schools, colleges, offices, bus stands, railway stations. Every drunkard spends money on local brand liquor and wastes time, energy and lose health. Even some regular drunkards beg small amounts of money and ask hot drinks from some known drunkard mates. Some governments owned wine shops earn substantial revenue directly. All the people are influenced to take the liquor on one occasion or the other. It is a very well known fact that in any major political election, municipal elections, local body elections, panchayat elections, company or factory elections, society elections and others, the liquor flows like water. Without the supply of liquor, people look like not tempted to work or participate in elections. These are the backdoor methods to tempt a person. Some people consume liquor due to frustrations, family problems, financial problems, domestic problems, and whatnot problems. Of course, reasons are plenty to consume liquor. Persons who are alcoholics have one reason or the other to substantiate them. Naturally, regular alcoholics will not find their growth easy. Their family life gets dislocated and disturbed. They often lose patience. They land in financial troubles. They never get social respect in family and friend circle. They are never able to meet good medical treatments in needs of time. Due to lack of funds, people never come forward to help morally, morally or financially to drunkards. In some states, liquor flow looks to be seen as more than cash flow. In some states and villages, Drinking water is not available to common person, but all types of liquor is made available at cost. At some places, whoever purchased liquor, water of 100 ml or 200 ml sachets are given free of cost. It is many at times observed that drunkards and regular alcohol drinkers are always irregular to their professional works due to an easy, ill health and hangovers. Regular drunkards' mind will be very simple that they will want to consume liquor somehow. Drunkards always speak non-stop and good orators at that particular intoxication time and power of speech will be more. They get extra energy at some particular point of time. But drunkards become weak and slowly lose their health and land in major health problems. Drunkards longevity is reduced. Drunkards lose their social status. Family reputation will be lost. Living standards will fall down and social respect will be lost. Children's education will be disturb disturbed and many long run family troubles and disturbances are to be foreseen, which even can lead to divorce of husband and wife, all due to consumption of alcohol in fighting within the family and domestic circles will be frequent and regular. For alcoholics and drunkards, there are the addiction centers, rehabilitation centers, nature care centers, and many other NGO centers could be seen at number of places. Such centers addresses could be located through search engine websites like yahoo.com, google.com, redifmail.com, and others. Trunkards can reduce 
their drinking habits, smoking habits, and other narcotic drugs habits slowly if they want to stop consumption of all types of intoxicated items. Every person has got the God-given willpower. All the good habits pay on one day or the other to a person, and for bad habits, one has to pay the cost at one time or the other. D-R-U-N-K-A-R-D-S-W-O-R-L-D, D-R-U-N-K-A-R-D-S, live in third world. Enjoy and dream more. In this world of life, some people are accustomed and habituated to social drinking of alcohol, including wine, vodka, brandy, and cocktails. Please listen and read to this total story by clicking the YouTube link.